Now the first component we want to create is the golden rectangle. And um, later on we want to be able to drive the dimensions of the rectangle through the radius of the sphere. So this graphic just basically shows how these dimensions um, relate to each other. And of course there's a bit of maths behind it, but that is actually quite simple. If you want to have a closer look at it, you can pause the video now. Basically it just boils down to Pythagoras and then substituting values and you get a formula which defines the rectangle width um, in relation to the sphere radius and the golden ratio. So let's start with a new mass and basically all we need is a rectangle so let's just use the model lines switch to rectangle and make sure that make surface from closed loops is checked and 3D snapping is unchecked and just draw a rectangle here we want to have this rectangle centered so we're going to use the uh, dimension tool to create some EQ dimensions and we also want to be able to drive the width and the height for that we need parameters and in order to be able to create these parameters we need some more dimensions here so we can label them so let's call this one width and this one we'll call length. And I'm choosing type for both of these because um, conceptual mass families are by definition um, or by default non-shared families, which means I can just as easily hook up um, the type parameters um, when I load this into another family. So let's go to the family types and add some more parameters. What we need is of course the golden ratio which we'll add as a new parameter. And let's just use a number parameter for that. That of course can be a type parameter as well. And there's a formula that defines the golden ratio, which is basically 1 plus the square root of 5, and all that divided by 2, which gives us our constant. And then the length should be width multiplied by golden ratio. As I said earlier, we want to be able to drive the whole thing through the radius of the sphere, so we need that too. Let's create a parameter for that uh, and aptly call it sphere radius. Um, and that can be a type parameter as well. And uh, let's just give that a value of, say, 25 meters. And um, now we just need to put in the formula that I showed earlier, which is this. Okay, well that seems to work. So basically that's the family we needed in order to build our rig. Now we can save it and then continue with our rig. Let's call this um, golden rectangle. That name seems appropriate. And we'll continue with the rig in our next video.